Hey there, everybody. Pete Pardo here from Sea of Tranquility. Welcome to another episode of What's Hot with Sea of Tranquility. It's right. It's Wednesday. New release day here on the channel. This will be your last one, I believe, for this week. And whatever we got left will be next week. I still have a nice pile of stuff that just keeps accumulating that we'll get to in the next couple of weeks because we're, we're still playing catch-up on the end of 2022 stuff. And the new releases are starting to come in. So it's kind of like... Uh, out with the old and with the new, we'll be phasing out all the 2022 stuff over the next couple of weeks. And at that, at that point, it'll be, you know, mid, late March and whatever we missed in 2022, we missed. We'll move on to 2023 stuff. So here's a really cool uh, fusion album, jazz fusion, all instrumental stuff from a uh, bass player from Finland. His name is Huka Havisto. The album is called Reflections. This is absolutely terrific. He's from Tampere, Finland. This is his debut album, and it's available. You can pick this up on uh, Bandcamp. He, uh, you look up it's J U K K A H A A V I S T O dot Bandcamp dot com. You can also get this. Uh, Ken Golden at the Lasers Edge has this at lasercd dot com, and this is uh, all actually the Digipack version is temporarily sold out on the Bandcamp page, but it looks like they are repressing. And they will have some more in April, but you still you still can get the digital album right now, so that is available. So, on the album, and let's as the CD just comes jumping right out there. Okay, it's you know pretty basic here as far as like the packaging, but we've got uh, as part of the band here we've got uh, Huka Havisto on fretless bass, and he wrote all the compositions. You've got Johannes Granroth on guitar and Severi Serjonin on drums, and on Fender Rhodes and synthesizers, you got uh, Vili Itapelto. hope I'm saying all those names correctly. And it's uh, recorded, produced by Huka, recorded by Tapio Lienen at Latis, Lato Studio in Tempiri, Finland. And uh, like I said, this was released late in 2022. Absolutely fantastic. So you've got here seven tracks. Ripping jazz fusion melodic but if you like the more aggressive complex tones of bands from the 70s like return to forever mahavishnu or orchestra lifetime brand x that sort of thing with the melodicness of like weather report that's what you get on here lots of great lead melodic bass lines ripping guitar work from johannes uh an amazing amazing player and uh, you got four days after is the first track all the songs range from uh, you get a couple that are like six seven minute range but most of them are around five to six minutes long dancing in the woods three reflections nora n-o-o-r-a opus number eight that's a killer track opus number 11 also killer those two you put them together it's roughly uh, 15 minutes long right there and then morning dew not the classic morning dew um at 5.59, okay, just under six minutes long. I really like the way, and the, the Fender Rhodes tones are killer on this album. If, that's why it said if you, if you like classic 70s fusion, you're going to get a lot of those similar type of uh, tones and passages here that pay homage to those those great fusion albums of the 70s. Uh, the guitar, Like I said, the guitar soloing on here is just incredible. Really, really strong. Um, love the keyboards. Love the bass. The drumming is, is really good as well. This is, uh, here, there is a quote on the Bandcamp page. There's a quote from the great Leland Sklar, of course, the bass player. Legendary bass player was played with Phil Collins and Crosby, Stills, and Nash and recorded with Toto. He's recorded with everybody. He goes, this sounds great. Really harkens back to all those great 70s fusion albums. And that is absolutely, absolutely true. So I think if you are a fan of stuff from the 70s fusion jazz fusion jazz rock from the 70s you need to hear this this is one of the coolest jazz fusion albums i've heard like in the last few months and i think uh, this is an absolute keeper great bass player and composer huka havisto reflections killer guitar killer keyboards killer drumming the whole band is red hot and i would say do not miss this if you can get your hand on a copy i'll put the link to the bandcamp page down below but also scoot on over to lasercd.com ken golden hopefully still has copies of these he just got a bunch of these in not too long ago so uh go check them out and visit us on the web at www.seatranquility.org we're on facebook we're on youtube all together all the damn time please subscribe if you haven't already and click on that notification bell so you get alerted for all of our content as it posts and please also before you leave do hit the like button we very much greatly appreciate that also down below in the video description we've got the links to our ko-fi ko page for channel donations as well as our merch page where you can get uh, all sorts of sea tranquility gear 
T-shirts, lots of different designs, hoodies, pullovers, and zip-ups. we got hats and caps and posters and all sorts of fun stuff. So go check that out as well. And I thank you all for watching. And we'll see you next week here on What's Hot with CH Tranquility. we got stuff. we got Wukan Live. we got the new Sienna Root. we got new Haken. we got uh, new Vantage Point, new Celeste, new Molecule, Jade Warrior reissue, uh, new Rick Wakeman, all sorts of stuff coming up here. Uh, reissue from Afro Rockman, all sorts of stuff. So uh, stay tuned for more over the next couple of weeks. We'll keep bringing it to you. Till then, I'm P. Partle. Take care. Bye-bye.